There's three rules of Kids Bible Club. All right, let's pray. Thank you, Lord, for this day. Thank you that we can have some fun with the children. And we pray, Lord, you bless our time here today. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Okay, last week. Anyone remember? Here's a hint. Anyone remember? Oh, no. Simon, we went camping. We forgot everything now. Do you remember Simon? Ezra. Ezra? What did Ezra do? Prepared his heart. Prepared his heart. Very good. All right, let's read the verse together. You ready? Ezra chapter 7, verse 10. For Ezra had prepared his heart to seek the law of the Lord, and to do it, and to teach in Israel statutes and judgments. Now we're going to read a verse from one of the twin books. Don't swing your legs, sit quietly. Very good. From the twin books from Nehemiah. And this is where I get the title of today's message. I am doing... Eyes up here. Eyes up here. Look up here. Look up here. Good. You ready? I am doing a great work. I am doing great. Who's doing great work? Well, we're going to find out. Come sit down, Jeremiah. Here's the next memory verse. Long one. Nehemiah. That's how you say this. Say it together. Nehemiah. Ari, Atticus, eyes up here, say it together. Nehemiah, try again. Nehemiah, very good. Nehemiah chapter 6, verse 3. And I sent messengers unto them, saying, look at this, this is where I get the title from. I am doing a great work, so that I cannot come down. Why should the work cease whilst I leave it and come down to you? So what was going on here? Nehemiah was doing a great work for the Lord. And there were people there trying to stop him from doing the great work. And he's saying, why should I come? Why should the work cease? Why should it stop? And I come down to you while I leave it. I'm doing something great for God. So you want to make sure you're doing something great for God. Right? So what is the great work we have to do for God? Who knows? What's the great work we have to do for God? Send messages. Message about what? About God. What's his name? What's his name? It starts with J. Jesus. Very good. Okay. So you see here, I am doing a great work. Notice. It's not we are doing a great work. Nehemiah made sure it was him. I am doing a great work. Can you say that about yourself? Can you say, I am doing great You might say, hey, our church is doing something for God. But are you doing something for God? That's why, look at this. We need you, you to do a great work. And you to do a great work. And you, and you, and you, and you, and you, and you. And you. Everybody working for God, Right? It's not just good enough just to be part of a church that's doing something good for God. We need you. Right, Jeremiah? We need you and you and you and you to do a great work for God. Okay, and what's that great work? Abel had it right. To tell people about Jesus. Death, burial, resurrection. Explain how he died for our sins. And how do we Make sure we're saved. Who knows the answer? It starts with B. Timothy. We have to believe on the Lord Jesus Christ. We call upon him to be saved. We need to tell others. So what are some ways we can be part of this great work? Where can we tell people about Jesus? Where do you think these people are? Where are they? Talking about the Bible. Talking about the Bible. But where can we talk to people about the Bible? Where do you think these guys are? At a park, yeah. Or maybe they're at school. 
Or maybe they're at the park playing and they're talking to other children. You can explain, he's explained to him about Jesus on the Bible, how he died, how he was buried, he rose again for him and for him. And if they believe on him, they can be saved. That's the great work. We don't want to stop doing the great work. We need everyone doing it. Okay, what's another place we can do a great, this great work for God? We can share the gospel. Where's this? What do you think, Simon? Yeah, sometimes when you're traveling somewhere, maybe you might have a conversation with somebody on the train or an airplane or the bus. And you're on your way, you can talk to them. Say hello, ask them if they're a Christian. If not, you can tell them about Jesus. And another way, and this is how we do it on Sunday afternoons. What's another way? All right, Sarah, what do you think? What's another way, Timothy? Oh, no, you guys know the other. Soul winning. Soul winning. So we go out, what do we do? Knock, knock, knock. Yeah, we knock on the doors and we go to people's houses. We go house to house and we go meet people we haven't met before. And we can tell them about Jesus and we can tell them about how to be saved. So that's another way. So that's why three ways. Sometimes we meet people in a park or in a public area somewhere. We can talk to them about Jesus. Sometimes when we're traveling on a train, the people we sit next to, sometimes we can talk to them about Jesus, or we can go find them in their homes, knock on the doors, tell them about Jesus. This is a great work we're in, and we need everyone. You. You. Need you. And you. Yeah? And you, and you, and you. All of you. We don't want the work to cease. All right. Oh, what's, a, what's another place? You can tell people about Jesus. What do you think? In church, yeah. Look at all these kiddies down here. We hope all the adults, we hope, we hope all these people know about Jesus. Sometimes they don't. But sometimes we have people in our own church that don't fully, shh, no talking, no talking, don't fully understand about Jesus. So you can talk to each other. Make sure everyone here believes in Jesus. Is that right? Okay, let's read our verse one more time. So this is the great work we're in. You ready? Let's read it together. Nehemiah chapter 6, verse 3. And I sent messengers unto them, saying, I am doing a great work, so that I cannot come down. Why should the work cease whilst I leave it and come down to you? All right, let's read it together again. There's nobody reading it with me. Ready? Let's try again. Ready? Nehemiah chapter 6, verse 3. And I sent messengers unto them, saying, I am doing a great work so that I cannot come down. Why should the work cease whilst I leave it and come down to you? Okay, so we need everybody here as part of the great work. Okay? Hope you learned something there today. All right, let's stand up. We've got some games to play today.